guys, Dosen Craft here, and we are right now in Camden, Maine, right um, the same town where we stayed last time we were out here. We stayed in Portland the night before, but yeah, really, this is where we stayed. We are staying at the end by the sea, which I'll make a little room tour of, hopefully by the end of this tour. We are just kind of walking around right now. We're looking around, seeing what's, seeing what's up. You have a little inn over there. You got these nice schooners here. Pretty cool. You see, they're also pretty. You can see that the wires are also pretty low, as you can see, but it's still cool nevertheless. Remember the waterfalls? No, I'm recording. So. All right, we're getting ready to get out of the car right now. As you can see. Okay, we're ready. So all I gotta do right now is put on my jacket, then we'll start our way out. Man, I have so much junk in here. It's clouding my mind. Okay, so we are now outside with my mom. For DSLR. Which I actually use sometimes to record my videos. Pretty big uh, thing over here, if you ask me. Pretty deep water. Okay, nice. I'm actually gonna. We're gonna go on over here to this little boardwalky area. It's kind of deep, as you can see. You can see something inside of there. Can't exactly tell what it, what it is. Definitely not seaweed. It looks like there is some sort of like bag down there or something. I can't exactly tell what it is, but it's something. I don't exactly know what it is. So over here you have this. Again, I don't know what that's about. Pretty nice view over here. If you're brave, you get to walk down over there to the pier. But life is great, so I think I might as well go ahead and do that now if my parents will let me. Or at least don't badger me about it. Okay. Mom doesn't want me doing that because she thinks I'm too strict. Because she's, she's too strict. So, yeah, you got this little boat here, it looks like. Pretty nice. So, hey. It's pretty, uh, Let's see what else there is over here. There's my dad right there. Lobster traps right here. Okay. Alright. You have your trash can. You are ones that are economic. <laughs> I'm gonna go over here with mom. She is right there. We have a little plaque here. Main Windjammer Cruises, huh? Alright, let's go. You have a church over there. They ring in their bell like they do every hour. You got the little waterfall over here. I've actually been to Camden before. Uh, I was about seven years old when I did so. Six or seven? I think I was six. But I, uh, I don't remember. I don't remember. Do you have this thing here? I don't know what it is, but there's some here. And you have this giant bag thing over there. I think that's a sail, actually. 
Might be a shit. Might, might be a sa Oh my god, I can't speak today. I think there might be a sale. I know, but I don't want to give it a good Really Nice. Alright, so we just uh got out from over there. We're now over here on Main Street. Hey, hello Ray, how you doing? See what's up. Place over here called Star called Starboard. Oh my god. This is my sign. No stupid people beyond this point. <laughs> hey, bad joke, kid. Hey, bad joke, guy. So that's funny. Sorry. Dang it, yeah, this is my sign. No stupid people. Yeah. Yeah, I think that I put that sign like right up in front of my room. That is funny. 19 Main Street. You have a little shop here. At this over here. The Lord Inn. <laughs> Sounds kind of. So, um. They're closing, buddy. Yeah, they're closing. Yeah. Yeah, they're closed. Please don't. So, um. Black Sea over there. It's kind of nice. I've always found these things kind of creepy because they play songs that you don't want. So I've always hated those. And of course, the obligatory Illuminati confirmed. Illuminati confirmed. Illuminati confirmed. It's the obligatory that. A little collectible store looks like kind of nice. Kind of trendy. Got some new stuff here. This is my thing. And it looks pretty nice. Cool stuff there, it also looks like. Very nice. I'm gonna head back out. So there's the Lord Inn, the Lord Camden Inn. It's nice and big. Stone Soup. Uh, never heard of that. Place cold. Marionaire's restaurant. Nice place to have like some, some dinner or something. You have a little dolly here. I actually remember this from last time. It was pretty nice. It, it, it had this really... That, that nice smell. That nice, that nice deli smell. It, it attracts you. You have this messy, messy blueberry pie. I think I'd have that, but in a less messy condition. <laughs> nice view of the scenery over here. It's pretty, pretty nice. You can, doors you can open up. Put some fresh air in. Pretty nice. Me and Dad, we're just gonna look around. Me, and Dad, and Mom, we're just gonna look around. Pretty nice. You even get your own little area here to kind of chill at. Pretty nice. Kind of small. I like the loftish design of this place. Especially these things. They just look awesome if you ask, in my opinion. These things, you can like hit them, you can smack them. Like cord wars. Bam, 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 bam. Made up thing I did. This. The window. Mom, this whole area, pretty nice. You also get some nice healthy white bread. I think I probably have some of that. Uh, you got your, so as you may know, Dasani water is kind of the king of the world. This one not anymore, so. Like I said, it looks pretty nice around here. So, as many of many people know, Dasani water bottles is the king of Chicago in many terms. But, not in Maine, it looks like. Nope. Poland Spring, it looks like. They are their version of Dasani. Wrote a little tea there. Like I was here. Nice. 
I smell real randomness here now. So Poland spring water, pure quality. Interesting. Toy near for my food now. Chilling, you know. And this is that famous wood texture that I use on my Insta on my former page. Just kind of chilling, you know. Um, got this nice cap here. Dad's on his way over. He's got more Poland spring water, which, as I said earlier, is sort of like Dasani of these guys. So yeah, these guys are like a total, well, let's just say this, X. I don't know if you can see the X there or not, but I have a little X there. Let me wipe that off so that no one knows it's there. Cool. Thing, a little map there, kind of nice. Uh, there is, there's actually a hotel here that we kind of liked. It was called the White Hall Inn. Um, it's pretty nice actually, from what I remember. It was, it had this nice charming feel. It's, it is kind of homey if you ask me. So I, th I wouldn't be surprised if it's still here or not, but it's definitely a possibility. I heard something was going on about new ownership or so, so I don't know if like renovations would be possible. I hope not, but anything's possible, you know? So we're just chilling, waiting for my food, and it's kind of cool, you know? Did you find a hotel in here? Funny, there seems to be a large amount of reflections in here. The reflection being almost too good because if you see me put my hand out, I was there to see something touch in there, and you can see my feet. Cool. Interestingly enough, my feet aren't actually moving. They're just staying cool. So I don't exactly know how they're doing that in the replica bot. Kind of creepy. This place is like haunted or something, but you can definitely notice that. My feet are moving, but if you notice over here, they're not moving whatsoever. And wow, it's stopped there, kind of creepy, but hey, you see where I'm going here? See where I'm going here? I'm just gonna let it do this for a little bit. Kind of weird though, you know? Well, our food's gotten here, and as you can see, it, it actually looks pretty nice. So we have pickles with two grilled cheese sandwiches. That was my favorites. I actually pretty like these, like a lot. And we have some milk. Mom's having something very similar with an extra pickle. Dad's having something very similar with no pickles whatsoever. Pretty nice, as you can see. I'll be right back after I eat. Alright, so I've dug through my entire layer of grilled cheese right now. My whole layer of pickles. One survivor. Still working on the grilled cheese. And when you zoom it up, it actually looks like you just want to savor 
every tiny bite. Nice. Well, Mom's giving me part of her pickles, you can see. <laughs> and like, if you actually zoom it up like this, ask one question to yourself. How the heck can you not resist this? Can you resist it? I mean, yeah, how the heck can you resist it? Look. How the heck can you resist this? Wow, you really zoomed in. Wow. So when you live under the hood, you say things like yope, wrecked, and, and yo dog. But I don't think this counts as living under the hood. <laughs> unless, you know, they smack, unless like right down here, they smack like, yo dog, get wrecked. And so it says like, you know, random dude, yo dog, get wrecked. And then below it, it says, other dude, yope, I'm gonna go get wrecked. Now that'd be weird. What was there tour guide saying? I don't think I got it as well. Hey, well, here's something interesting about Maine. You may have heard of the famous book Where's Waldo? Guess what? There's a Waldo County. It's a town called Waldo in it. And all the way down here in Lincoln County, you have. That's right, people. You get Waldo Boro. Man, people just love making this stuff now. It doesn't necessarily make any sense. 